welcome back to another video with legit colleen so today i'm going to be showing you guys how to go straight to your app when you open a customized app that you made in shortcuts instead of making it go to shortcuts when you click on the app first and the action playing out before it actually goes to the real app because it just takes forever it's annoying and i know so many people were asking me on one of my previous videos on how to change your app icons video so many people are asking how to fix that and i didn't know but now i know so here we go you're gonna click this link in the bio i mean the description box it's called icon themer and you just want to click add to your shortcuts and then it's going to come to your shortcuts but it's not going to let you use it so you have to go to your settings to allow it and you can do this method at your own cost at your own risk guys if you don't want to do this i have a alternate way to make it better just keep watching the video for that so you want to go to your settings you want to go all the way down to shortcuts and click allow untrusted shortcuts and allow it's asking you if you don't want to do this keep watching i have another method pin in your password and you want to let that do its thing they want to go back to icon themer i mean your shortcuts and then gonna download the icon themer and scroll all the way to the bottom and allow untrusted shortcut or add untrusted shortcut it's going to ask you if you're on ios 14 just click continue if you're not make sure you go and download it because it'll make it better and once that is done and you click your region and everything it's added to my shortcuts so look at the bottom and click my shortcuts and then you are going to click on it and it was asking me to update but i just click not now and then it's going to bring up the app thing so you can actually use it so since it doesn't work on system apps which are apps that come with your iphone already you can only use apps you download from the app store so click search in app store and then you just want to go ahead and search the app that you want to do the icon picture for so i'm just going to use netflix for this tutorial so i type in netflix click done it's going to bring up a bunch of apps from the app store and i click actual netflix app just click on the logo ask you to verify click okay and then it's going to ask you if you want to keep the same icon or choose from photos. I'm choosing from photos so it can match my blue theme on my home screen. And I'm going to just click OK again. And then we're going to... I'm just going to pick the photo for my theme, which is like a blue picture. And then after that, it's going to let you name the app. And I'm just going to name it Netflix with a emoji like I always do. So once you are done with that, you just want to click OK. Then click Done. Just accept whatever it's saying. And then it's going to take you to a link and it's going to basically download a profile. So you want to click allow, but you have to install it. So we're going to go to our settings. At the top, it says profile downloaded. So you can just go straight there and click it to download it. But if you do not see that on your phone for any chance, just go all the way down to general and scroll all the way down to profiles. And then see Netflix icon, which is why I named my thing. Click install, then enter your password. Or whatever and then it's gonna say it's not signed so click install on the top right corner again or left wherever it is for you then click done now that it is installed so when you go to your home screen you're gonna see the netflix icon or whatever icon you made tiktok whatever on there and you're gonna click on that and it's gonna take you straight to the netflix icon well for me the netflix app instead of going to shortcuts first so i'm gonna show you an example so i'm just gonna click on the little bitty icon and look it's open to netflix straight away like period Poo. we did that i showed you how to do that guys and now you don't gotta worry about waiting like five seconds for your app open especially when you're in a rush like you know it gotta open mad quick so that's how you do it guys i hope you enjoyed this video please like comment subscribe turn on notifications for more but wait if you do not want to do this because you are scared or something of that sort i'm going to show you how to make it better it's not going to be going straight exactly but i'm going to show you how to make it better so if you need that keep watching okay now that everybody who doesn't want to do that method is here i'm going to show you how to make this shortcuts thing a little bit quicker for your phone so it doesn't go as slow it's not going to be going exactly but it helps i'm going to show you how the shortcut works now you see it goes to the shortcuts app then it goes to the actual app and it takes forever to load to be honest i hate it 
but just go to settings you want to go all the way to accessibility right there you want to click motion the green icon right there and then you want to click reduce motion and you can also put on prefer cost fade transitions i prefer to put that on i feel like it makes it better than just reduce motion and i'm going to try it again and let you guys see how it turns out and in my opinion i think it loads a little bit faster than before if you agree tell me if you don't so be it i don't care anyway that's all for today's video i hope you guys liked enjoyed please comment subscribe if you need any questions you have any questions please comment i answer to all of them love you guys and see you in my next video